Hello everybody. We're out here on a nice, pretty calm May day and I'm about to test out my latest contraption, which is a converted 9.9 .9 horsepower Johnson into um, a 3000 watt nominal, but about 17 kilowatt max electric power head. So I'm gonna go do a little uh, test run. Let me flip the screen here. Got it nice and pretty tidied up. Uh, everything is contained under the cap, which is nice. We've got uh, our controller here. Let's see if I can get out here and get to the uh, lever. All right, so there's our power supply. I mean, the motor, basically. US 3000. And um, I've got a couple little packs here, 72 volt packs to test it out. I should be able to maybe go eight or 10 miles is all I think I'm gonna have range. I got a few um, gauges set up to show power levels and speed and depth. And it's a 14 foot riveted aluminum sea nymph. So I will get more video once we're out there on the water. Okay, here's a little bit more of a detailed tour of the converted 9.9 .9 Johnson two-stroke that is now electric powered. We've got the QS motor 3000 watt, rated nominally 3000 watt um, electric motor. And that's coupled to the existing shaft that was the drive shaft and um, it's difficult to see in there but there is actually a coupler that's 3d metal printed coupler i did not make it but i ordered that from a company online it looks like this this is my plastic 3d printed coupler with the four spline which is going downward and the six spline goes on to the motor so this is what joins the two shafts together. Inside there, I had to make this little channel iron bracket to space it properly, and it's just long enough to stay under the cover. So everything was pretty tidy. I need to do some better waterproofing of the wiring here. It did keep the splashes off. There was quite a bit of spray from this open skiff. Um, so I'm going to improve on the waterproofing. This is a Votal EM150 SP, I believe. Uh, I think the maximum output is 250 amps for sport mode output. It uh, had a 9.5 by 10 pitch prop on there. It actually has a little bit of a wobble. I ordered another prop. That's a uh, nine and a quarter by 12 pitch. That should get us up around 20, 20 miles per hour, maybe a little bit more, maybe like 18 knots, something like that, which I think will be adequate. Um, I've got my homemade 72 volt pack here that I believe was about a 24 amp hour pack. And it's disconnected at the moment. But what I am going to do is put a bigger LifePo 4 battery pack with roughly a 150 amp hour capacity up forward in that bay. Um, yeah, so simple three speed throttle controller. You can use the reverse here or you can, I can actually use the uh, forward and reverse built into the outboard. So for the cooling system, I don't know how effective it is. I didn't get any temperature readings off the motor when I was out there, um, maybe on a calmer day, but I tapped into the existing impeller uh, connection down there, and then it just does a few loops around the motor and spits out the water here. So I'm sure it's helping, and the cover is ventilated 
So we're getting some airflow through there as well as the um, cold water surrounding the motor. So hopefully I won't have too bad of an overheat situation. It's not heavily loaded currently, but I'll be adding a couple hundred or so pounds of batteries. So it might be working a little harder on the next trip. Anyway, those are the, a few of the internal details. So I wanted to make that available for you. Well, here I am out in Mud Bay. Um, we made it uh, a couple miles from the harbor and I was easily able to get on step. Uh, it's got plenty of power. It was maxing out though around 16 or 17 miles an hour. It was getting up on step around 12. Um, I might be able to adjust the, uh, or get a different prop pitch or change the um, flux weakening settings to get more RPMs. I don't have RPM gauge at the moment. And um, I, it seemed like it was, I just adjusted the, the uh, tilt of the outboard a little bit. Uh, see if it can pick the bow up a little bit more. I was getting quite a bit of spray. It felt like it was riding a little bit bow heavy, but uh, anyway. Nice day for testing this. We've got just a little chop. And uh, yeah, so resume the video overboard. Difficult for me. Video while navigating. 